coming up now, I believe after track number four is where they start providing more laps. So, oh yeah, this will be part two now, so welcome to part two. <laughs> uh, not that I really needed to say that, but I just thought I'd say it anyway because we, well, it's past the 15 minute mark. Okay then, next track is Cobblestone. This one's in the countryside. And speaking of countryside, uh, I'm, I might have mentioned as well, like for New Year's Eve or Hogmanay, as we call it up here in, in Scotland, but New Year's Eve, uh, for anyone else uh, who's watching, like, uh, but uh, I spent it in the countryside with uh, one of my friends' house, houses, and it was a great time of me spending uh, my first ever New Year with my friends, and it was brilliant, like, we were outside, like, dancing the music and stuff like that, drinking and like, I know some of you in the comments might call me, oh you're an alcoholic and stuff like that. To be quite honest with you, I don't really drink all that much. I mean, I do drink on a few occasions. Or if it's for a special occasion. Or if it's something that, well, for a good reason to be honest. I don't like, I'm not like a regular drinker in any way. Oh god. That was a, that was a bit of a collision. The three of us fell for bikes. I thought it was just two of us. Didn't see the red one. didn't see that red guy falling off his bike but anyway I don't really drink all that much as I said before and well, this track might actually be a bit harder than I thought because of well because of that thing that this happened at the start it's gonna maybe make it maybe make it a bit harder for me to catch up which I quite like because I mean to be quite honest I was getting bored like being in front of everyone all the time and whoa wow that was a, <laughs> a weird glitch I thought I was gonna fly in the sky there for a second <laughs> Well, not like Harry Potter. I mean, this isn't Harry Potter. It's not a flying car. Flying bike. <laughs> oh, you just jumped in front of me. How rude of you. Right, now let's get to the start line again. But yeah, all in all, I had a really good time there. I'm even counting down the bells as well, like to the 2014. Or counting down to 2014, not counting down the bells, but uh, to 2014, it was it was brilliant. And I'm certainly hoping this won't be the last like time that I'll be uh, spending New Year's with my friends. So, okay, that really slowed me down there for a second. And I better get going because they're catching up. I really like the music track for this as well, I mean, especially the guitar, I mean, like, the guitars in these tracks, I mean, well, I can say, like, the solos are absolutely awesome. That's all I'll say about them, like, two A's, absolutely awesome. Or, or just one word, awesome-tacular. <laughs> even though that's not even a word, still, it's two words combined into one. Even though it's, I have no idea, but, <laughs> just kind of being random there. But yeah, that was a bit of a weird glitch that happened earlier. I sort of nearly ended up flying in the sky. It actually looked like I was about to fall off my bike. But you might have saw that like in a split second, like if you pause the video on that moment, then you might see that uh, I was going to be flying in the sky. Oh, oh god, again, and I got bumped over to the other side. It's like this game's thinking, you cannot fly anywhere, you need to stick to the track. And I'm like, I understand this game, but do you need to really force me on the, on the way back with your glitches, sometimes? <laughs> well, that was a good... Oh, I was going to say, if the track was over there, I... I thought the announcer would have provided a brilliant time in there. It's like, yee-haw, that was brilliant. <laughs> well done. Okay, right. Don't freeze, please. Thank you. 
I was going to say freeze a few plays, but I'm like, no, no, don't even think about thinking about that clarinet. Don't think that. Even though it would have been a good jinx, but... Anyway, track number four is done. So now we're more than halfway there to getting this uh, championship completed. I think luck is in my favour for the game not crashing so far. Right, Puddle Stomp. Oh, I'm surprised it's still only three laps. Okay then, so this one... What's this one again? I can't remember. This will be raining obviously since, well, the title Puddle Stomp will be raining on this track. The loading times for this game are m perhaps a bit slower than more Racer 2's, but since I'm playing this on the PS3, I think it, uh, I guess the loading times like down like it reduces the loading times a bit. I think I might be wrong about that. It might be the same loading times as it always is on like a PS1 or a PS2. Two, one, go. But I always remember talking about, like, I mean, or, sorry, not talking about, uh, playing more Racer 2, like, back all these years ago, like, on the PS2 and stuff. And I don't ever remember it crashing when doing any championship modes. Although I don't think I've ever completed all the championships on this, so this will be probably be a first time. I, I think it's the same track, except it's all, well, it's just raining. Oh god. Didn't mean to hit the barrier there. Well, not barrier, but like, oh. I don't know why, but sometimes in general, I think rain on racing tracks is easily distractible, I think. Oh no. Whoa, that was close. Right, we'll go in here. See, it's kind of dark here, the lighting in that bit is particularly poor. Oh god. Didn't see that corner coming right there. And then so hopefully I'll... Or I need to get back in front because I'm in third place. But to be quite honest, I've got a good heading anyway. I mean, even if I... Well, I don't want to lose the race, obviously, but like even if I come second or third on this race, it doesn't really matter, to be honest. I've got a lot of points anyway, as it is. Alright, checkpoint. Yeah, I need to be careful on this track, because there's tight bits on this track that I didn't actually see coming there, but now I know they're coming. So I say, thank thankfully I didn't smash into them, otherwise we would have fallen off both of our bikes. Right, and I believe it was... Uh, I wasn't here. Do you know what I mean? Like, that was, a, that was an overdub of the voices. Or here, you hear where I'm, I'm... Yeah, you, you'll see, you you would have heard that, the overdubbing of the voices. Oh, jeez, yeah, I, I needed to break there, but otherwise I would have fallen off again. Alright, final lap. final lap. Let's make this a good one. I got little jumps on those. I was expecting a bigger jump, but whatever. Ooh, this is this is really exciting actually. Me, just jumping, jumping on these bits. On getting all these extra jumps is really exciting. And oh god. Yeah, I was kind of keeping an eye on the computer to make sure, like, uh, everything was going smoothly. Making sure nothing was crashing or anything. Okay, and oh... Ooh. Right, thank goodness I didn't hit that barrier. Uh, that guy's right behind me. Hopefully I should be able to finish it. Yes! Yeah. Alright. Okay, I've said yes more than enough times now. Alright then. Okay then, so track number five is done. 
I was about to say, yes, you're turning into like Daniel Bryan now, except he's a bit, uh, you know, over the top, like, well, I wouldn't say drunk, but like, he's like, yes, and it's like, yeah, that sounds like you're really, uh, drunk, if you say that. <laughs> I have no idea, but the announcer sometimes, his reactions can sometimes be funny, but sometimes they can be a bit creepy at the same time, I have no idea why, but... Some of you guys might not be able to think about that. Well, it's not really creepy in the way, it's just kind of like, yeah, that's what I'll say about that. So I say, come on, PS3, don't let me down. You're doing very well. Hang in there. Our game as well, even. Hang in there. Don't let me down. Or don't let all of us down. Three, two, one, go! Alright, here we go. Right. Snow track. Okay, thanks for the boost. Even though I don't think that was supposed to happen. I had the match was surprised that was a boost. I actually thought it was going to fall there off my bike, but there we go. Anything can happen in races. I believe this is the last more racer game that they made for main consoles, I think, or especially for PlayStation 1. I don't know, I think they, I remember them, what was it they did? I think they released a more racer game on the Game Boy Advance, I think. Oh, thank you, announcer again. But, uh, I'm not sure if they released one on the DS as well. I'm pretty sure it's just the Game Boy Advance. I might be wrong about the, uh, the DS. Well, this is quite a short track. Did that in less than a minute. We'll see if I can beat that record. I might be able to do that if I do like quite a lot of wheelies. Oh yeah, I'm doing the we trucks again if you press like R2. Uh, the, the biker does the, the small tricks on his bike while he's uh, flying in the air. It's like, whoa, look over there. <laughs> New Final lap. Yeah, not much jumping involved in this one, but to be quite honest, that's, that's fine. I mean, like, this track is good as it is, I mean, the snow is really good in this, although, although it's not really good on, like, from what I'm looking at on the TV, but I'm pretty sure on the computer it look much better, because a clearer picture, or sharper picture, better quality, another an all-in-all -all picture on the computer. <laughs> Again, another truck is just sticking his leg out. Just one leg. I know if it was like, oh, I'll just be daredevilish. This isn't Stuntman, you know. Well, speaking of which, Stuntman for the PS2 is another game I'm going to be covering in the future as well. And that's where we're going to finish off this race. Okay, there we go. Why do you keep saying that? Anyway. Right. Number six. Down and out. Why does he keep saying that? I have no idea why. I mean, I think it's because I'm like, either he's really excited that we're going to be going to get a huge jump, or we're just getting top speed on that. I have no idea why, but whatever. Also, uh, what do you guys think of the more racer games all in all after watching these videos? Because I'm. Pretty sure that uh, for Let's Plays wise, there has been some videos up of Let's Plays, but not really full complete ones from like what I'm doing, especially More Racer 2 as well. As far as I know, I think I'm the only YouTuber that has actually done Let's Plays of these games. So, uh, 
well, I might be wrong. I probably will be wrong, but uh, all I know is that like I'm the most.